for checking out our video on installing an SSL certificate on Microsoft IIS 7. So after your SSL certificate has been issued and downloaded to your computer, you have to ensure the certificates are ready for installation. First, ensure the certificates are stored in a secure location. If your certificate was sent in a zip file, it has to be extracted before we start the installation. Now, for the purpose of this demonstration, I'll move the intermediate certificates to their own directory. Sometimes the intermediate certificates arrive in one file with an extension of CA-bundle. So first we'll install the intermediate certificates. Open the Microsoft Management Console by clicking Start and in the search box type in MMC. In the MMC, click on File, then Add Remove Snap-in. Add the certificate Snap-in. Select Computer Account and click Next. Then click on Finish and finally OK to return to the MMC main screen. Now we'll expand the certificates. Right-click on Intermediate Certificate Authorities, then All Tasks, then Import. Click Next on the Welcome to the Certificate Import Wizard. Browse to the first Intermediate Certificate and open it. Now click on Next. Leave the radio button on Place All Certificates in the following store and ensure Intermediate Certification Authorities is selected. Then click Next. Click on Finish. Now repeat the steps for the second Intermediate Certificate. Now you're going to want to close the MMC window. You don't need to save the console unless you want to. To install your certificate, return to the Server Manager. Click Expand Roles, then Web Server IIS, and select Internet Information Services IIS Manager. In the Connections panel, select your server name. Now in the Features view, double-click on Server Certificates. Here in the Actions pane, click on Complete Certificate Request. Now browse for the certificate for your domain. You might possibly need to change the file filter from star.cer to star.star. .star. Select your SSL certificate. It's got the name of your domain in it. Now give your certificate a friendly name. Make sure you use one that you'll remember. Once the certificate is installed and showing up in the Server Certificates window, we can bind the certificate to a website. Expand Sites and click on the website you're trying to secure. In the Actions pane, click on Bindings. If HTTPS is already listed, then click on HTTPS and then click on Edit. If this is the first time you're using SSL on this website, you'll need to add, change type, to HTTPS. In SSL Certificate, drop the box down and select the friendly name you used when importing the certificate. Click on OK, then click on Close. So, thanks for watching this video. Be sure to check out our other videos and stay secure.